गाइज हियर इज द ऑल न्यू यू टी एल गैमा प्लस थ्री थ्री फाइव जीरो ए वेरी फेमस हैवी ड्यूटी सोलर इन्वर्टर विथ लिथियम बैटरी सपोर्ट एंड एज वी नो दैट वेन एनी काइंड ऑफ मशीन स्टार्ट वर्किंग फॉर एग्जाम्पल दिस इन्वर्टर राइट हियर दैट मशीन इज गोइंग टू कंज्यूम सम अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी फॉर इट सेल्फ बिकॉज इट हैज अ लॉट ऑफ कंपोनेंट्स इन साइड इट इट हैज दीज एल ईडीज इट हैज दिस डिस्प्ले एंड सो ऑन and this kind of energy consumption is known as idle draw or self power consumption some people also call it power loss because this is basically a small amount of power being wasted for itself when it is not providing any kind of useful output so today we are going to measure the idle draw of this utl gamma plus 3350 solar inverter working with 24 volt battery bank and to prevent any kind of confusion what i have done is i have taken a few precautions so let me show it to you over here on the back panel as you can see this is the mains power cord all right and it is not plugged in so the inverter does not have any kind of source from the mains voltage here is the load output plug all right and this thing is disconnected so we are not going to have any kind of load output on this inverter and here are the solar terminals and again as you can see they are disconnected so this inverter does not have any kind of solar input available so what it means is that for today's video there are going to be only two equations one is going to be this solar inverter and the other equation is going to be this 24 volt battery bank which i have the inverter connected to all right and to take the measurements i'm going to use my trusty clamp meter so this is sigma 313a a truly wonderful device if you want to buy high quality clamp meter like this one or if you want to buy this kind of solar inverter then a bunch of affiliate buying links will be available in the description or in the first comment for you guys to check them out so this clamp meter here is in the dc voltage range all right let's hit zero and i'm going to put it on this positive wire over here which is connected to the inverter all right now what we are going to do is we are going to turn on the system we are going to turn on the circuits of this inverter using this power button right here so what i'm going to do is on the count of 3 i'll be turning on the inverter you guys also have a neat little button available for you that button is known as the like button available right here below the video so let's press these buttons together shall we 1 2 3 there we go the inverter is now on as you can see it is ready to provide the power to the load but as you can see the load is not connected on this socket so any kind of consumption that this inverter takes from the battery is just the self power consumption or the idle draw of this device all right are you guys ready so here we go and the idle power consumption of this device is 1.6 amperes and this thing is connected on a 24 volt battery bank as you can see these are small automotive batteries for testing purposes this thing is linked and the system voltage is 24 volt but uh, what we'll do is we'll take the exact battery voltage from this display and if you want to know if this display is accurate or not i already have a video available for it in the i button or in the description for you so this battery bank is currently sitting at 25.2 volt what i'm going to do is i'm going to use this calculator let's turn off the flash so you guys can see it clearly okay i hope this is in focus let's hit focus all right so what we saw on the meter was 1.6 amps it's coming down a bit yeah you can say it's 1.6 into 25.2 volts and this is the self power consumption or idle draw of utl gamma plus 3350 that is around 40 watts all right so even when this device is not doing anything it is kind of using up 40 watts of energy to sustain itself if you want to see this kind of power loss or idle draw measured with respect to other inverters then there will be a bunch of cards popping up over here on your screen you can click on them and watch those informative videos as well that's it for this neat little video guys take care and have a nice day